Hey YouTube, this is Brian from Custom Fast RC, uh, bringing you an upgrade for the off nose, the GTP2E, and or the Dirt Oval. They are very similar. Um, this is RC Persuader's car. He's the second to have this upgrade done. Rockbud was the first. Rockbud has version one. This is version two of it. I've made some changes to it and did some different things. You are able to mount your XL2 right on top with screws, not two-way tape. If you want to run the uh, Mamba Monster 2 on here, we could uh, make changes to accommodate the Mamba Monster 2 instead of the XL2. That is a uh, Steve New 1521. Accommodates this motor with no problem. Um, I think I went as low as a 23 tooth pinion all the way up to a 34 tooth pinion. Take some of this stuff away so you can get an overall view of everything. You see, we'll mount right there. I just cut this window out here to take some weight off of it. Uh, if you don't like the windows, um, I can make them as a solid piece or holes or basically whatever design you want to put into the top of this thing, really. Uh, centering the diff, the center diff comes with this upgrade. It aligns the two uh, drive shafts front and back straight down the middle of the chassis. The way they come stock, it is offset a little bit. I don't know, to accommodate earlier designs for the Nitro or what have you. Um, in my opinion, I think by straightening the drive line out, it takes uh, less energy to turn something that's straight than something that turns on angle. Stock version, you can see how the drive shafts are definitely on an angle to the front and back. And I do like revision number two better because it takes and straightens out the top plate instead of having a bend in it like Rock Buds does. In order to do that, I do have to make revisions to the bulkhead. And again, I think the biggest spur you could put in there is a 40. And as far as what I'm told, nobody goes much bigger than a 38 on these, so should have no problems. Uh, one of the downturns to this upgrade, you will have to send me your car. Um, I do have references for people's cars that I've had and there are no problems. Everybody's always gotten their car back with the way they sent them out. Uh, I've had Rockbud's cars here, uh, Jess 34 753's cars. Um, I've done some stuff for Ross Deal, and this is RC Persuader's car, so I will treat your car like it is my own, and when I ship it back to you, it will be uh, packed properly. So, but yeah, if anybody is interested in this upgrade for their Ofna GTP2E or Dirt Oval, um, just hit me up. I'm going to leave my uh, email address in the comment section. And uh, hit me up and we'll go from there. Just a review. You get the top plate, which stiffens up your chassis, supports the two differentials from any type of flex, ties everything in together. You get the center diff. And any type of configuration you want, as far as uh, the windows, we could leave the windows out, go with some holes, whatever you want to do. Um, I will anodize it. It comes black, but if you have a different color you have in mind, we could do a different color. And it is not crazy expensive, guys. It's uh, very affordable. So... Yep, if you're interested, hit me up, and uh, we'll go from there. Until next time, 
talk to you guys later. Good night.